<clears throat> Wait, is that one in your window up there? Yeah, it is. Oh. You gotta jump on your car. I don't think I can jump high enough to get that. Well, I guess you can. <laughs> That's the other problem I'm facing. I guess you could just go through the oh, window. Oh, dude, right here. They're they're getting they like ascend in height, dude. Nope. You have little faith. You haven't landed on one yet. Yeah, but a cuckold is known for his dexterity. Oh! Couldn't land on one yet, you say. Couldn't land on the important one either. Listen, I'm just gonna have this fucking go straight up my asshole. Ha! Victory. I've acquired a funky pot. Wow, what is this funky pipe doing here? Is he watching the bull and my wife? How exciting. I will nickname you Heckin' Fat Chunkin' Red Boy. There's a special <laughs> place in my collection for you. Okay, real quick. Didn't he already own this? Yeah. What does he mean there's a spe uh, This is... Why is he naming it now? Heckin' yeah. Chunky Funky Boy. Also, I like how he's like, are you watching my wife? Are you watching the bull? Keep your eyes on him. Even though they're literally just standing there. I wish I could get caught. I've got a real exhibitionist fe like fetish. Yeah, I like doing things in public too. Yeah. I just like, uh, what, what's it called? Humiliation fetish, that's it. I, I, want, I want my wife to yell at me for looking at her. Nothing would make me more happy. She yells what I will get too. That'd be cool, you know. I mean, most women do that anyway. They usually just yell at me and say, Stop talking to me. Get away from me. You're very talented, son. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Time for you to leave, bro. Go find your toys. We're <laughs> not toys. Turn off the TV that's not even playing. I go to bed and go to work in the morning. I don't want to look for funky pops for the rest of the day. No. Ooh, fuck yeah, finally. I, I bet you it's like a day-by-day -day thing that monkey pops show up. Okay, well, that message was there when I went to sleep, so I guess it's just broke. If you can believe it, not, this game is not very well in terms of functionality. It's not broke, it's differently able. It ain't broke, it's fixed. Don't bug it. I'm gonna go to Chinatown. Or was it worth it? Yeah, go, go to, to Chinatown. Yeah, I think. I, yeah, I want to go to work so I can get enough money to go to the nightclub. Duh. Oh yeah. I Don't you know a thing about the cuck I world? Was, I forgot about the fucking vampire lounge or whatever. Hey, fellas, I'm back at the office. Hello, Greg and Brian and Bill. Don't worry. I'm here. That's it. End of the sentence. What's up, Steve? I haven't explored work. Oh, really? Wages do not enter. I'm not allowed to go in there. Go in anyway. Of course it's locked. That would be too easy. What do you think this your boss is, is doing in there? I don't care. I, this world is opening up to me, you know? When I first started playing this, I thought, this kind of sucks. But now, now I'm starting to see a world of possibilities. Like, wow. my boss's office is locked. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> a Chinatown is locked. Chinatown, yeah, just like real life. I can't go there anymore. There's a funky pop right there. I mean, I guess it's always here, but that doesn't matter. It's time to work using fucking Windows 10. Huh. I don't know what it is. Another 95 buckaroos. <gasps> I can't believe I heard 95 dollars at work today. Hey, man, I can go to the nightclub. Let's go to the nightclub. Nightclub. Let's get to that vampire lounge. I wonder if there's there's probably Funky Pops here. Hey, what's that over to the right? That looks new. I should go check it out. Well, did he know he was in for a big fucking surprise? I feel like this is the Pride Month edition. Yeah. Just because the rainbow flags everywhere. Why just is that so like angrily? I'm that? pissed. I'm pissed that they're including people. I hate inclusivity. Hey, this is new. What's this? 
I know what you're trying to do. Do you want to be the chick or I, I do? I don't think that's it. I mean, maybe it is. You, do you want to be the pink Amanda? Or I could be pink Amanda. See, I'm just trying to figure out if it's a man or a woman because I, I, you know, I, it doesn't really matter. I'm trying doesn't, to... Does, does, why does their gender matter? You know gender isn't what you think it is. It's the voice I'm going to give them. Oh, okay. Well, what kind of voice do you think a pink Amanda would have? Hello, welcome. It's Pride Month. This is the Pride Pop Up Shop. And just so you know, my pre my, my pronouns my, pre my pronouns are she slash her. Wow, Pride Month already? I had no idea. I have definitely not seen anything about it on TV or social media. Yes. I kind of hoping it would just keep going on. <laughs> yeah, it's like a wall of death. No, I'm straight, but I'm an ally, I swear. I'm not plotting against you. Uh-oh. Nonsense. We're all a little bit gay, at least. Your heteronormativity is showing... Uh-oh. Heteronormativity. Heteronormativity alert. Have you never been aroused by the sight of a man? Well, I guess <laughs> I I know do. I can't claim that. <laughs> I guess I do enjoy watching Tyrone and Life. And Tyrone identifies as a male. So. There we go. You are gay or at least bisexual, see? Wow, this is fucking awesome. I don't like this agenda that it's putting out against the LGBTAQCFD community. DCF. <laughs> DC uh, Marvel community. UHF. <laughs> does that mean I can celebrate? Oh, I, the microphone is in the way. I thought so. Do you, does that mean I can celebrate piss month? <laughs> That's really, really insensitive. I celebrate. I'm gonna need, okay, I'm going to need you to stop. You can't say that. Listen, buddy. It's 2021. You can't say piss instead of pride. It is the current year, okay? I'm not saying piss instead of pride. I'm saying piss because well, I'm piss inclusive. <laughs> piss inclusive month. Piss exclusive. But of Sorry. course. But first, you have to choose your sexuality. I've determined that you are bisexual or gay. It is up to you to make the final call. Whoa. That is a lot of pressure to put on me at such short notice. What if I regret my choice? It's not a problem. You can change it at any time. Sexuality is fluid. Okay, this is getting to be too much. You, okay. <clears throat> you aren't allowed to criticize these people. Gabe. Get it through your thick fucking skull, developer. What is your new sexuality? Uh, other. I think I'm something else, actually. Nonsense. I've already determined you are gay or bisexual. Are you saying I'm wrong? Yes. Well, no, I just... And you said it's fluid. You are new to this community. I don't know why I stopped doing any voice. It's just me. I am a man. <laughs> I am Amanda. You shouldn't be so arrogant. I know what is best for you. Now let me ask you again. What is your new sexuality? Other. Just keep saying other. I think I'm something. Oh, it's just going to be the same thing, okay? Fuck yeah. you, Amanda. She slapped her. Hey, hey. Fine, be gay. Just be gay. I am gay. I am gay. Gay pride badge. Yada, yada. You are now gay. I feel like I'm part of something big, like Cox. <gasps> wow! We're loud and proud. You got it, boss. What the hell is in this? It's a funky pop. Wait, why is it? Yeah. What the fuck? Oh, it's a bunch of vibrating dildos. Ha ha ha, because... Because gay people... Gay people have dildos. Gay people like dildos. You know, like other people don't like dildos. No, nobody in the world likes dildos but gay people. They weren't invented, you know... They weren't invented for fellas like me. For, for anybody like that. Let's go to the Vampire Nightclub. Slow down there, Chief. Club is for members only. You a member? You a member? I'm a VIP, in fact. Don't fuck with me, man. You're not a member. Not gonna lie, man. You look like shit. We already saw this. Yeah, I'll purchase the membership. I am now the cock. Yes, I will buy the membership. Although I don't appreciate the insult. I'm married, you know. Other men want my wife, too. It's a status thing. 
Whatever you say, man. Dot, dot, dot. Yep, that's 150. All right, Chief, you're in. All right. Time to party. That's not me saying it. Time to party. <laughs> you dang old cat. Get, get out of here. Get. I'm going to play with your fat foals when you angrily look at me. Okay, I guess just sit down. Whatever, dude. You're an asshole. See you later, bouncer. Time to go meet all the... Come on. Developer. How many times do I gotta tell you the same message before you fix it? So you can have Deshaun, your wonderful son, do the Fortnite dance on top of your car, but you can't have NPCs do that Why in the club? Why isn't every single NPC flossing? I want them all to be flossing and doing the default dance and like horribly like off time signatures, like off of each other. Oh look, a girl! <gasps> she cute? Oh, she's hen- she's a-, a She's <laughs> hentai. She's a hentai girl. Are you a real life enemy girl? Ew, you're boring and ugly and broke. Whoa! I've heard that one before. Don't talk to me unless you got drugs and a lot of money. I mean, at least a thousand dollars, loser. No, I've definitely heard that All one right. before. All right. Maybe hey, I have a chance. I just need drugs and money. Perhaps someone knows where I can find drugs. I should ask around. <laughs> you know who I'm thinking. That... Don't... Don't say it. The fucking bartender, dude. I don't think that's what you were implying at all. Who are you implying? Uh. Uh. We're not. Well, I can't talk to any of these common grays. Stripper who is perfectly NPC, still. Probably just part of the fucking background. I am the stripper now. Who wants to see me naked? Oh, here's another bartender. Maybe he can tell it's me. Mr. Chong again. Oh, this is Mr. Chen, you insensitive piece of shit. Hello, I am Mr. Chen, bartender. What do you want? I don't know why that changed from Chinese to Mexican. You need drugs. I'm looking for some. Not any leads? You go to Chinatown at night, look for my cousin. <laughs> he sells at drugstore. Oh, yes, yes. A fucking Latino now. Also, I'm sorry I got them mixed up. They look... You just got to go to Chinatown, man. They look... Go find my cousin. He's a Chinaman in Chinatown, man. Well, what does he look like? He looks like me. <laughs> Everybody look like me. Hey, that's insensitive. I'm only saying that because Mr. Chong looked like him and they were... No, I'm saying the accent. You can't give him a Chinese accent because he's Chinese. Which, that wasn't a Chinese accent. Yes, it that was. That was Latvian. <laughs> Latvia? Latvia. Oh, if it's Latvia, it's okay. Latvia is a... Or, it was actually a Bosnian accent? I don't know what to do Boston accent. I can do a Boston accent. Time to start off the day! <gasps> I love day four! Is someone in the room yet? No, my wife's gonna just be in there standing with Tyrone for the next six months. She's just on her phone and he's sitting there with his fucking... I bet he says the exact same thing. I'm not even gonna bother. Yeah. Back to work, Wagey. Oh no, shit. Well, you can go to China. I've got to go there at night, though, to buy drugs, and I need a thousand dollars, which is. Is this really worth, like, playing over and over again? Ninety-five dollars? I have to do ten nights in a row. Dude, it was just fucking. Maybe I'll get a raise for being. <sighs> Time to work. <laughs>